we left South Africa in 1961 and we got on the ship in Durban and stopped off in Cape Town for a couple of days. We'd been there for about 400 years since so we reckon it's time to leave. Uh, we went organic uh, about 30 years ago because we lost confidence in agrochemicals and we suddenly realized how very dangerous they are to work with. Uh, the reasons for going organic uh, would be first of all to protect uh, our health and the health of our family and the workers. The second reason for being organic is uh, to protect the the soil, the farm itself, which is very, very badly uh, damaged by use of agrochemicals. And the third reason to go organic is to protect uh, our clients, the customers, the people who actually consume our products. In the last 30 years, um, no chemicals have come through the gates of the orchard. It's very different from all other gins, it tastes very different because it has an apple flavor. Well, most of the, of the other gins in the world are actually just uh, flavored alcohol. So they, they buy in an industrial produced alcohol um, and they flavor it and put it in a pretty bottle. What we do though is we actually grow an organic apple uh, in this lovely soil that we have. We then juice the apples and we ferment the apple juice for a year. We put it through its primary fermentation and the malolactic fermentation. And when it's a really classy, good vintage cider, we then distill it. That is where all the other gin producers start. They simply buy that spirit that we've gone to all that trouble to make. So everything uh, is, is made on the estate. <laughs>